What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of black screening or stuck on loading screen issue you're currently having with 7 days to die. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, clicking onto the Windows symbol and using your Windows search function in order to find Windows Defender Firewall, so just simply type it in. So once this tab pops up, simply left click or click enter in order to open it up. Once this tab pops up, navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking to allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. You're going to click that. Once this tab pops up, navigate to the right hand side, click on to change settings. Afterwards, you should be able to click on to allow another app. And then on to browse. And I can't really tell you where it is located because on every single PC is located somewhere different. So you're going to type it in or search for it. So for your seven days to die. And once you found it, click on to open and this task and click on to add. This will probably fix your issue. That's it for the video, guys. I hope that I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, comment or a subscription. And yeah, guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.